What's the, what's the point of this? Um, do you have anything you'd like to say? No, I really don't. If you don't feel like talking about anything right now, that's okay. I'd like to spend time with you. We can just sit for a minute if that's what you need. I mean, if, that, if you think you're, I'm going to benefit from that, sure, but I don't. I don't really have anything to say that I haven't already said. Okay. Well, in in about five minutes, your time will be up, so I'll stay here with you until then. Okay. That's fine. Okay, so this is the one where the patient says that they don't want to talk. And so the nurse, again, might feel rejected or feel like, you know, I'm not getting anywhere with this patient. But the thing is that you you might be tested by the patient. So you should commit to the time that you said you were going to spend with them. And you could say something like, um, I'm going to sit here until our five minutes are, are up and then uh, I'll come back and, and try and talk to you later on today. So this gives the patient the opportunity to understand that the nurse means what he or she says and that they are back on time consistently. And it also gives the patient time between visits to assess how he or she feels and what they may think about the nurse and perhaps might feel less threatened by the nurse.